In this video, I'm going to show you how to kill a Jihad. So that's the gear I normally use when I was going to kill a Jihad. But I'm going to do a more of a poor man version. So anybody can really afford this gear. In all reality, the bolts cost the most money, and all those bolts combined is equal to 300k. You really only need like 100 bolts. So this is really the poor man's version of Jihad. So you're going to notice that there are multiple different creatures when you come jab. You're just going to do the 10 wave version. Just go for the fire cave, that's all you really want. The other things that you get are not really worth it that much. So here you go, you're going to try to bring about 8 super restores. And then you're going to bring 2 range pots and 2 defense pots. This really is like my favorite amount. In all reality you can bring less prayer pots and not use the pair as much, and in all reality that would work, so you get more food. In all preference, you probably bring better food than that brought, but again, I'm doing poor man's version. You don't want to keep the deck from age on at all times when there's level 360s. Personally, I kill everything but the 360s first. Some people, they kill the 360s first and then they switch the pairs. Honestly, I prefer just to protect the mage on. In this version, the 360s don't even do really damage to you, so it's actually kind of nice. So yeah, in all reality, Fight Caves is quite easy. If you scroll to 9 minutes and 30 seconds in this video, that's when Jad starts. Jad's also quite easy. When he stomps on the ground and slams down, you protect from range. When he stands up on his hind legs, you protect from mage. So basically, you're just looking for that stomp. The rest of the time, you're going to be for an age. If you watch this video, you might be able to you know, do a little bit better than that. But some people, all they do is protect from age unless it is range. And if you stay away from Jad, Jad won't move towards you. Sometimes the server's weird and you'll end up moving towards Jad, but basically just move away so Jad can't melee. Because if he melees, you're kind of boned, so it's really hard. Yeah, Jad will do really not that much damage to you if you know what you're doing. Yeah, hopefully this video helps. I hope you have a good time. Enjoy the music.